Let's start with the question, make sure we know what we're being asked. The student wants to introduce Katherine Halverson's book to an audience already familiar with the Atlantic Monthly. So we want to introduce the book, and they have to be already familiar with this, I guess it's a magazine. So let's see if we can accomplish those goals using these bullets. So the Atlantic Monthly magazine was first published in 1857, don't care. The magazine focused on politics, art, and literature, don't care. In 2019, historian Katherine Halverson published the book Far Away Women and the Atlantic Monthly. Um, so... Yeah, that probably matters because it's, it's the book. Its subject is female authors whose autobiographies appeared in the magazine in the early 1900s. That probably matters too. One of the authors discussed is Juanita Harrison. I don't think that's going to matter. Who cares? So let's, let's take a look at the choices. Um, a. Catherine Halverson's Far Away Women in the Atlantic Monthly discusses female authors whose autobiographies appeared in the magazine in the early 1900s. Yeah, so I think that's going to be it, right? It discusses the book. It discusses the magazine. Obviously, it names it. But it doesn't describe like what it is, right? So there's this um, bullet point here, bullet point two, where they're like describing what the magazine is. But if you're already familiar with the magazine, you wouldn't need to know what's in the magazine, right? Like you know that from being a reader. This feels right. I'm obviously going to read the other choices, but this seems to be checking all the, the pieces that I need. Um, B, a magazine called The Atlantic Monthly, referred to in Katherine Halverson's book title, was first published in 1857. No, if we're familiar, we know the magazine. We maybe know it's been around for a while. Plus, this doesn't introduce the book. It says that she has a book, but it doesn't even say the title, so no. C, Far Away Women in the Atlantic Monthly features contributors to the Atlantic Monthly, first published in 1857 as a magazine. No, so the first part's great. The second part is introducing it to people who might not be familiar with the magazine. So it's, it's not what they're asking. It might be useful for someone who doesn't know about the magazine, but that was not what you were asked to do. So don't give them information they don't want. Uh, D, an author discussed by Katherine Harrison is Juanita Harrison. No, this is going to be wrong. Whose autobiography appeared in that. No, it's doesn't even put the book. So it's definitely A. Um, yeah, just make sure, as always with these outline questions, that you are not giving the information that you personally find most interesting or informative. You are given a task. You have to give them what they want. And in this case, this is interesting, the task was basically give us less, right? Give us less information. We already know what this magazine is, so don't you dare put into your choice what the magazine is about or what it does. We already know that. So that's an interesting thing that the SAT is doing here. Usually, uh, especially since you have this for school a lot, your, your instinct is to provide more information. You always think more is better. No, especially when they tell you less is better, give them less.